So they saw Drayton return to Rollsby, possibly for the last time for the next couple of years. Dave, there was a little bit of rain early doors, spiced up the pitch. Juiced it up a little. Juiced yeah, it up a little. Yeah. I mean, you lost the toss. Surprisingly, a man of your calibre, pretty good on the, on the guesswork. Um, you'd have probably decided to bowl, I reckon. Definitely, with that shadow of doubt. We were looking pretty solid. I mean, I was out on point at the time. What were you? Uh, 12? 12 for naught. 12 for naught after seven, seven overs. We were looking pretty solid. That's a decent start for us. We're fairly pleased with that. We batted all the way down to six. We were doing well that day. Four wickets in about 12 balls later. Things weren't going quite as well, were they, Dave? No, we were pretty much up the creek without a battle from then on, really. Uh, we only had ten men because there's an RAC problem with one of the boys. No problem, Marsh. You maintain your 100% record. But um, things weren't looking good at that point, were they? No. It was uh, looking potentially a 50 all out job, wasn't it? Possibly less. At 18 for four, with the, with the players we had to come after, it was literally me, not really putting my best performance with the bat this year. Fletto, who is basically been awful with the bat this year. And then we're looking at Graham Palmer and Thackeray, who, the greatest will in the world, aren't going to dig you out of a big hole. And you can't expect that. But, um, so old 92 in the end, probably, considering where we were, wasn't the end of the world. We, we got escaped with some sort of self-dignity. But they bowled well, the, uh, the Drayton bowlers. Cornfield especially used the conditions well. And uh, their opener, um, Skipper, also bowled extremely well. That slower ball, deadly. Took for daddy. Did did for daddy. All ends up. A man possibly in the finest form of his life. And managed to do him. So great bowling by them. Uh, but we came out, heads held tie. Wasn't going to get us down and you haven't 92 to defend. Oh, well, we, well up for it. We made a good effort. At 10 overs we played, just uh, before tea was ready. The kettle wasn't quite boiled. But we won't go into that. Um, two early wickets. Great performance from the bowling again. Definitely. Me and Purse opened up. Used the conditions just as well as they did. Indeed. Possibly didn't have the luck. The luck that they did. What, that they were bowling off? <laughs> <laughs> we can bowl yeah. off every week, we probably, we probably win most games, but we don't worry about that. Um, but they, they they played very well towards the end. Chris, uh, Chris played very well, saw them home at the end. Took a bit of lighting to Fletty. Unlucky Nick. But um, apart from that, good performance all around. Sadly lost. But, you know, we can build on this. We've got building brocks. We've got the cement out. We're laying them down. We've got the foundations. It's just a matter of getting runs on the board and fielding performances like that. Well, um, exactly. maybe if we, if we posted easier. 192, would have won. I think without a shadow of a doubt. 140, probably been a decent total, but can't worry about it. We'll just battle on to next week. Give them Bob Ross. Yeah, we've got to take our eight games with Buckingham. Exactly. Big game against Buckingham. Really need to win that one. Definitely. Eight the last game of the season. Need to win that one. And we've got Whitson and Melton as well. I mean, can't really worry about it. No, not at all. Well, never mind. In about three days later, you'll get another one of these, and we'll probably say we've lost, but we'll do it with style and some other stuff.